yo 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 what is up guys it's your boy ty here and today i'm gonna be bringing you guys a little bit of a different video it's not gonna be a tune or anything like that but this is more gonna be for like new people or people that are trying to reach like the max level in game as you guys can see i'm level 29 in game i would need like hundreds of thousands of more points to hit like level 30 probably but if you're new to the game and you want to level up so that you can unlock new cars the ultimate mod body kits or whatever the case may be i've been doing some testing for a while and i figured out that doing the tandem drift is the best way to make money or not make money but doing tandem drifting with yourself is the best way to get xp it doesn't matter if you're new or if you just if you've been playing for a long time you can literally do this on every map it'll give you the same amount of xp um but the only thing is is with this is the better the score you get the more money and xp you get so i've tested just doing the regular drifting and it doesn't really give you that much xp i've tested the time attack it doesn't give you that much xp online doesn't give you that much xp but tandem drift literally will give you the most xp so if you want to level up quick as a new player what i would do is just go to parking a and start doing these so for example i'm going to go ahead and do a test run just to show you guys how much xp you can get you can get up to thirteen thousand xp which is a lot more than the 100 or 300 you get for time attacks and drift tracks so look i'm gonna go ahead and do a run and also another thing about this too is that if you do these it'll make you better at tandeming it'll make you better at drifting it'll teach you how to hold a line so while you're actually you know getting these experience points you'll actually be gaining experience and learning how you drift and possibly learning how you could drift better just from tandeming with yourself so oh i almost missed that zone there but so that's going to be the lead run this is how it goes so you just do a lead run and then once you're done with the lead run you just press continue and then it'll ask you to pull out a another car so the car i'm going to use is hmm i'm going to just pull out the r35 i think it's on 100 adhesion okay r35 against the s15 and then it's going to have you do your chase run just like this you want to make sure that when you're doing these you never hit the wall too hard it's a collision and if you're chasing you want to make sure you don't hit the lead because it counts as a collision and it'll restart it so if i hit the lead it'll be a collision like that and you'll have to restart so i just want to keep that in mind for you guys you know do not hit the, the lead and do not slam into the wall a wall tap is fine but if you hit the wall too hard it'll count as a collision and you'll have to restart just like that so just keep that in mind keep that in mind also if you guys need help with tandeming or anything like that I have a car extra racing tutorials playlist where you can actually learn some tips and tricks on how to tandem you know what i'm saying so if you guys need help with that go ahead and check out the tutorials video i'll put a thumbnail of it up on screen right now if i can but if not you should be able to find it i've made like literally two or three videos about it so shouldn't be too hard to find hopefully all right so as you guys can see from this run here it's going to give you a few different options it's going to say restart watch you play or retry second race but if you want to see your results and get paid and get xp you just press results and as you guys can see i got 9,000 xp from that now if you want to compare that to something else like we can compare that to a time attack a drift track anything i promise that this this method will give you literally the most xp so for example i'll pull out one of my faster cars and i'll do like a time attack and it will not give me that much money so if i do a time attack let's pull out the low key m4 we're gonna do a time attack let's just do like a parking a time attack something really really quick that we can do all right so it says for gold you get thirty thousand. if you get under a minute and 19 seconds so i'm gonna try to get under a minute and 19 seconds so let's see how much xp we get from this there we're good we're good so right now we're at 20 seconds almost 30 seconds getting a little bit of drifting action in there a 
and yes this is this is one of my race cars for like stuff like this or for like messing around on drag racing this is the car i use right here it's pretty cool okay tight turn tight turn cut through here so we're at 50 seconds right now i don't know if we're gonna get the hit or if we're gonna get the one minute to 19 oh no we're gonna get the one minute 19 we're gonna get under it we're, we got it we got it okay we got it we got it so for this right here let's see how much xp we get so for this i even have times two and i get 170 xp with times two only 170 so without the times two realistically i'd probably only get about <clears throat> let's say like 85 xp from that now if we do a drifting map and we drift the track you get like i think just as much or even less xp so yeah man um let me switch cars real quick hold on hold on it's the wrong car it's a race car i can't really use that to drift <clears throat> but also for those of you guys who don't know i am switching back 220 adhesions slowly but surely a lot of people are like already trying to diss me i just want to say this man if you if you don't like me for a setting in the game please just unsubscribe because that just shows that you don't you know what i'm saying you're not even on a level to where you can accept people for them so if you can't accept people for them bro if you can't accept me for being on 120 just unsubscribe on god but if y'all want to stay sub the people that have been here since day one since we've been on 120 since the start hey man then say sub and stay tuned because these 120 adhesion tunes gonna drop man you know what i'm saying but with that being said i mean this is basically gonna wrap up the video i just want to show you guys you know the fastest way to make experience points because i feel like a lot of people have been wondering and a lot of people have been struggling with you know uh leveling up and uh you know getting the things they want in the game due to it taking a while because you got to play this game for like quite a few days to like really level up and get through the ranks if you don't have much time to like play if you could like put in eight hour sessions every day it'd probably be no problem for you but if you have limited time which a lot of people do and you can't play for like a long time then doing these tandem drift things will probably be your best bet because like i said you can get up to thirteen thousand xp from those so um that is the best bet man like i said from the time attack we literally got what like 170 and that's what a times two multiplier the only reason i have a times two multiplier for all of my points is because um i have car x premium so you get times two like all your points and stuff like that and then from this we only got 840 xp and that's what times two on the time attack i didn't get a times two but we got 840 xp or experience points <clears throat> and that would be realistically 420 points so literally doing the tandems will be your best bet with well, that being said man i hope you guys did enjoy this video and if you did drop a like subscribe and share this video with anybody else that is having trouble or needs help uh gaining experience points and i want to level up and get the ultimate mod and new cars unlocked otherwise man you guys have a great day and i will see you guys in the next one peace